live here. So, <laughs> first of all, welcome back to Allison Bakes Your Day. This week I'm baking my friend Sean's day. He is Lena's wife. So I'm actually filming these episodes at the same time, um, but we're splitting them up into two different weeks. So I'm currently making Lena's Cornish pasties. So we still have all that chaos going on. But while the dough is resting in the fridge because it's warm in my space, I'm gonna start on my recipe for Sean. Now, Sean's favorite flavors are uh, chocolate, salted caramel, things like that. So we are going to make a molten chocolate lava cake, but instead of chocolate lava center, it's going to be a salted caramel lava center. So let's get started. First thing we're gonna do is make our caramel, add our sugar, to this pan here. Shake it around, make it flat. Combine this with a fourth cup of cold water. I'm going to stir this just to combine it with the sugar, the water. Once it's combined, don't stir it. Don't stir it. I know you, I know you wanna stir. We just have to let this cook until the sugar dissolves completely and it starts turning to a nice amber color. It's gonna take about 10 minutes, so, um, I'm not gonna make you watch it. Uh, well, I'll just, I'll just come back when it magically appeared. Two seconds, it'll be done. Okay, we have this very deep amber color here now. We're gonna get this warm cream in here. Ah, we're gonna splatter it everywhere. Have a weird day. Woo! Add in our butter, get that smoothed out our three-fourths of a teaspoon of salt to make it a salted caramel. Now that the butter and salt is in here, I'm going to take it off the heat and pour it into this jar. We're going to let this cool down to room temperature on the counter here for a little bit, and then we'll stick it in the fridge to get a little bit more solidified. I've melted some butter, and we are going to pour some in each of these so that we can coat the ramekins with the melted butter. I'm just gonna use my fingers and grease it. I have a tablespoon of cocoa powder and a tablespoon of flour in here, and we are going to coat the insides of these with this mixture. We have our chopped chocolate over here. We're gonna add our butter. Let this all melt together. Well, today's been a bit of a disaster, but uh, we are powering through because there ain't no quitters here on Alice Bakes Your Day. We are going to whip some eggs with some sugar, get it nice and fluffy. We are gonna try to whip some air into these because this recipe does not call for any sort of rising agent like baking soda or baking powder. So we're gonna make it some air happen. Sugar. We're gonna whip these for about three minutes. Those have thickened, fluffed up, and nice and pale yellow. Fold in our chocolate and butter. Fold with a rubber spatula. Fold it until there's no like dark streaks remaining so that we know it's all one cohesive thing. No streaky batter. Looks like we are good to go. Next, we're gonna fold in our fourth cup of flour. Swoosh, chop. Swoosh, chop, swoosh, chop. Sounded like I was like doing a dance move. It's like, hey, you guys heard of the swoosh and chop? Swoosh, chop, swoosh, chop. Just need a beat under that. Just need a oots, oots, oots under that and we're good to go, right? We are gonna put two thirds of this batter into the ramekins. What do we think? Yeah, that seems good, right? Only time will tell. A heaping teaspoon of caramel right in the center of these. I wish the caramel was a little more set. Maybe I should have tossed it into the freezer. We're still learning. That's the whole point. Whoops, batter down. What a day. In the oven they go for 16 minutes. Well, today has been a crazy day. The caramel, at least in this one, has seeped out of the center. And so I'm not sure there's actually gonna be a, a molten caramel center or if it's just gonna be caramel inside of it. <laughs> trying to do two bakes in one day, am I crazy? I'm crazy, I'm nuts. We're gonna try to turn these out, we'll see what happens. Let's do this one first since it seems soupy here. We're gonna get a knife around the edge. Let's see if I can do this. 
without burning myself. One, two, three, pack. Aha! Yay! Well, smells good, looks great. Sure, I'll take it. Do a little finish, a little flourish. We'll do a little. Oh, ho, ho. Beautiful. Well, thank you so much for joining me again for Alice and Bakes Your Day. I hope I baked your day. Let's see if I baked Sean's day. We're about to find out. <laughs> All right, I'm about to take my first bite of Alison Hawkstone's uh, chocolate lava caramel salted delicious cake. I might have added a word to it that's not there. Okay. Mm. Just look at this so you can see how moist it is. Mm. That's like really good.